Now, uh, still in politics, the New Patriotic Party NPP says the December elections will be won on the projects delivered to the people in the various communities. In Kwanzaa South, constituency chairman of the party, Charles Oswege, says they will also achieve victory with their solid united front. He says the NDC would have no chance in the upcoming elections as the people are encouraged by the NPP's many social intervention policies. He spoke to joiners during the inauguration of a 36-member campaign team tasked to retain the seat for the NPP in the Nkwanza South constituency in the Bono East region. Since 2004, the Nkwanza South constituency seat has been won by the NPP except 2012 when the NDC's Emmanuel Kwejo Ejekum won with a margin of 5,002 votes. But in 2016, the NPP regained their lost seat by a narrow margin of 985 votes. Speaking to Joy News during the inauguration of a 36-member campaign team for the NPP in Nkranza South constituency ahead of the 2020 elections, the incumbent and parliamentary candidate Charles Kunedu Yadom is of the strong conviction of retaining his seat based on the volume of work done. In the first place, my relationship with the, those people in the settler communities, I believe strongly I'm going to win. I prepare the building. Every community, I know the challenges confront them, I know their needs and aspirations are prepared towards it, and I know opinion leaders what they need, and are prepared towards it, and I believe strongly we are going to win. Aside the policies that His Excellency the President have uh, formulated, and in the area of free SHS, the implementation is successful, and we want to maintain it. And for that matter, I am fighting the two finals in order to consolidate the win over here, both the presidential and parliamentary. Constituency and campaign team chairman Clement Ousu AJ said their newfound unity gives them hope of victory for the party in the December elections. We had a very solid unity among ourselves as, as a party. Um, this, is, this was what was mixed. But today, fortunately, if you mean to have known our campaign team, I'm very sure our, our members in the other side will really be fumbling. There is no way the NDC is going to have a chance. Now, this campaign is going to be won based on the projects that our member of parliament have initiated, um, one of which is a, a, the mini markets that have just start, scattered around and across the, the constituency. One at um, Braho. Kuma, Don Kron Kwanta, um, the ICT center at, at, at Don Kron Kwanta. And then once again, you go to Bonsu, Beposo, Asunkwa, the road that he's constructing, doing all the bridges and the other things, other stuff. Those people have gotten the encouragement. So we're going to win. In fact, our friends at the opposition will see this team and definitely they will know that we are just moving to the uh, to, to the next level, that is to 2021. Charles Kwadu Yadom is going back to the to parliament, and Anado Dankwa Kufadu is going to win in Grand South. NPP Bono East Regional Chairman Thomas Eduapia during the inauguration advised party members against the voting of skirt and blouse. Policy is a paper way the other. And you divided front and you have 2020 elections. You are going to lose the presidential and that of the parliamentary. Let us be focused. Let us be united. Let us be committed in the course, in the delivering of this constituency to his excellency the president and we cannot afford to lose this election 2020 and kuranza south municipal chief executive Dina atakisiwa who is a member of the campaign team supported the team with three motorcycles for joy news pressure semevo and kuranza